Hi everyone, it's Andrea and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to do a flip through of the Deborah Muller book Cupid Cuties, which is her Valentine's book. So let's have a look at this beautiful cover. The usual back. So here we go. Let's have a look at what we've got. So we've got the usual belongs to page, which is a really cute one. That'll be nice to colour actually, I think. As with all Deborah Millers, they're good for markers. I do like using my markers in them. So these are all little cupids ready for Valentine's Day. So we'll just have a quick look through them and see what we can find. So this is uh, another cute one. They're all really adorable. Some of them are a little bit more complicated than others, but none of them are really so bad that you um, would struggle to finish them. And there's this one. This is a really nice one. It's got a little flying piggy and a rainbow. And then we've got Love. She's got uh, cats and dogs. This one's quite a new, new, cute one with her. So they're all really adorable in Deborah Muller's usual style. So I will leave a link below and I'll explain more about that later. But I just really like Deborah Muller. I'm really getting into Deborah Muller very, very much and I'm buying all of her books. So there's a lot I haven't got. So um, I might treat myself to one book I don't have. The one thing I like about Amazon, it does tell you if you've bought something. So it'll say, you purchased this book on such and such a date in such and such a year. So I know if I've got them or not. So so this is just adorable. So sweet. Yeah. I like the way she's holding the lollipops in front of her boobies. <laughs> I think it's so cute. <laughs> and it's got a list of fellas there. Hmm, who should I have today? Well, there's a pool on it for me. That is fantastic. Okay. And this one, this is quite a sweet one. So as I said, like, they're not complicated to colour at all. Not at all. She's eating the candies. She's crying and she's got a, a cushioned hug, so maybe she's a little bit broken. This one's a cute one as well. She's got an eye patch on. I think they're just really sweet. Love wins. She's eating a, a lollipop. <laughs> She's got a bandage on her eye. I think she accidentally hurt herself with one of her uh, her arrows. <laughs> I think it's so cute. Oops, hang on. Oh, another one there. Another one. She's having a cigarette and a glass of wine. I think she's had enough. She's on her way home and she is beat. And there's in the bath. I love this one. I think this one is fantastic. I just love it. I just love that one. I'm definitely colouring this one. Oh, this one's cute with her little letters and she's winking. And she's got the little love hearts. Back to work. It's all very, they are just absolutely stunning little pictures. I really, really like these ones. So, yes, I am collecting Deborah Muller books now, and I'm getting quite a small collection. It's nowhere near like the Jade Summer books, and they're very tiny compared to them. Jade Summer takes up a whole shelf, Deborah Muller takes up a bit. <laughs> But I'm very pleased with the ones I've got, so like I said, I will be buying more because I love them. This one's nice. And that's the last one. So then you've got all the, the usual stuff, so Facebook, colouring group. If you join the colouring group on Facebook, they do actually give you freebies every week. They give you one freebie page to colour. I've got loads of them that I haven't coloured. I've only coloured like two or three. I think it's actually two. There's an email, websites, Pinterest, Etsy, etc. And so that is Cupid 
cuties by Deborah Miller. I hope you've enjoyed this flip through. As I said, I will leave links below to where you can purchase this book on Amazon. I am not an affiliate. It's just there for your convenience. It only takes me a second to find. So I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.